So this is the Rocket Bunny Cafe in Yokohama. It's more of a bar than a cafe. It is 6 p.m. They just opened up for the night. They got here the Rocket Bunny Drift S15. Looks awesome. Race car. Aggressive diffuser. And into the inside is collection of licenses here. On the left is a shop where you can get your bling blinks. <laughs> There's rocket bunny lug nuts here. Bunch of t-shirts, toolbox. I think this shop is half sponsored by Topto, which is a famous tool maker here in Japan. T-shirts here. Tomei motor sitting here. I think this is a SR engine, SR20, I think. I'm not a Nissan guy, so I don't really know. Hey. There's one of the owners. Rocket Bunny skateboards, t shirts, stickers. Some Vokes up top. And then the bar area. Pretty cool. This is actually, this is a rocket bunny uh, emblem. See that? Oh, yeah. That's so cool. Yeah. So we're chilling at the bar now. And check out the list of drinks here. We got GTR cocktail, cereal cocktail. Fail lady is misspelled. <laughs> <laughs> Supra 86 to Jay-Z. That's awesome. But I gotta let them know if Harry is misspelled here. Is it? There's more to it? Anything cool? Bunny special burger. Huh? Fuck shit up. Spell it wrong. Fuck shit up. Keeping it JDM. Functional. 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 So the GTR has got a, a lot of kick to it. It's actually a cocktail with beer in it. Sylvia is gin based. 2JG3 is sweet and soft. Kampari? Uh, in Supra. Yeah, Supra. This is a fair lady GT. This is a fair lady. 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 The 86 is a sweet, another sweet drink too. Oh, yeah. I kind of want to try GTR too. GTR? GTR. So, Shara, so Shara, Box Shiribia is this car? Car is GTR. A lot of people come here, like Australians, go a car, rent a car at the airport, come straight here, and then go to the type of parking. This is like a big parking area where the meets are. Mm -hmm. But they come here and find out where the action is taking place, like drifting or racing for the night. Yeah. And meet up here and then go out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like the GTR drink. It's probably the best tequila drink I've ever had. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Tequila, Japanese beer, ginger ale. Ginger ale. Yeah. Skyline GTR. Yeah. Must have bought. Oh, this is weird. Yeah. It's like you guys got weird. But usually, you usually like to feel like this. I got the silver drink. Okay. Are you requiring yourself drinking? Yes. <laughs> Cheers. Kampai. <laughs> Kampai. <Come> Cheers. <laughs> GTR. Ooh, yeah. GTR. GTR definitely has tequila. Oh yeah. That, yeah. That, that's good too, though. Yeah. This is this is definitely the girl drink. This is. This is under 300 horsepower, yeah. That's different. <laughs> 400, 500 horsepower. Yeah. <laughs> I don't. I don't. You must go. Eh? Come here, just a word. English. Eh? Japanese. Just a word. I hope to see everyone come here. <laughs> Check out the rocket bunny shop here in Yokohama, guys. See you. <laughs> Just... Rocket bunnies. Good luck, share. I want to sit in it. Yeah, <laughs> nice. 
So that's it guys, my time at Rocket Bunny Cafe. Really chill vibe. It's more of a bar right now than a cafe. The owner told me that uh, he wants to turn the bar more into a cafe style lounge. So he wants to open it up during lunchtime. But for now, he opens at 6 p.m. and closes at midnight. So if you plan on visiting Rocket Bunny Cafe, make sure to go visit at night. Other people come straight from the airport with a rental car, visit the cafe, see where the meetup spots are and drifting are happening the night of and head out together. So it's a cool meetup spot as well as a cool place to get a drink. I got a Nissan Silvia drink and he got a Skyline GTR drink which obviously had more kick than the Silvia drink. But you know, I just sat there, hanged out. There's a little shop towards the front, like a skate shop too. So if you're looking for Rocket Bunny souvenirs, you can purchase some stuff too. So that's it guys. If you are interested in visiting the cafe, just look for Rocket Bunny Cafe on Google. Speed Hunters came here last year in uh, July, August time when they first opened. So you can check out their article on how to find this place as well. Check out the food apparently. And check out the food. Yeah, they actually have food, although I didn't have time to try out the food. Yeah. You can uh, so Kenji san actually served me uh, some drinks. So apparently he's a drifter, a bartender, and also a chef. So the guy does everything. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, if you're in Tokyo or Yokohama, go check out the Rocky Bunny Cafe. Good times, good people, I had a lot of fun. So peace. We're out.